Damn it. Alright! How you doing? Bit of a thin day. Up to this point. What do you mean it's a bit of a thin day? Why would you keep saying that? Because... Uh, no, it is. You know, I'm trying to big up, there's loads of stuff going on. It's, it's thin. <laughs> Huh? Got a message. My phone's got everything tilted sideways. It's dumb. <laughs> I have been jumping around phone calls today. Helping folk out today. Starting off with a phone call to tell me about breaking. It's not something that people generally need to worry about or want to have to worry about. There's a break in, stolen equipment. Later on in the day, I get another phone call. Damaged equipment, unrelated. Sort out mum's laptop today. Well, I sorted it out yesterday, but I got some of her config files over from the old laptop, which was uh, this killy dink, a Lenovo X200S, no trackpad or anything, uh, regular hard drive and stuff. She's been doing a lot of coursework and stuff on here. Transferred her config files from here to Yeah, a uh, Lenovo X240. Oh, that was a bit of a nightmare because uh, Mum couldn't remember her password for the laptop. Um, thankfully, it auto boot into the uh, main user space, so we didn't have to worry about it too much. But um, that could have been a bit of a problem. There was nothing on it, like literally nothing other than config files, because she was doing everything in the browser. Um, so just. Put all that stuff back over our bookmarks and stuff like that are all on the on the new machine. So we did that and uh, hammered out a part of her new CV, which uh, didn't take a whole hell of a lot of time. Her and Inky worked on like cover letters and stuff, and Inky started working on one for herself too. Um, and really. Um, that has been the day other than walk on the dog. Kids have been to school. Good days, both of them. And that pretty much lead up to now. How little can you do in the course of a day? I don't know. I should probably actually see what those messages were and cross your fingers that this video isn't like as if someone was holding their phone that way. Cause that'd be really annoying because it doesn't look like the gyro's kicked in to say I'm holding the camera the other way. No idea what those messages were. Um, I think the camera's spun around. Oh, it's doing it again. Hopefully it's flipping all of them around. It's flipped around the, the ones I filmed earlier, but why is that not flipping my camera around? Got a call on uh, during the live stream. Don't know what that was about either. But, uh, I'm supposed to be playing some games with the spuds. After live stream. No, I was um, typebroken on that thingy. Don't want any. What's the balls and make a walk? I ain't doing too bad. Oh, I'm hitting you, am I? No, 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 no. You can't check teammates. It oh, is. Okay. Oh no, oh, he's just blowing me up. Who me? No, that. I didn't get to play Smash. Um, Mum took the game. Like Mum was like Grr! playing Smash Bros. So I didn't play. I promised Big Man I'll play a few games tomorrow. I just had a bit of a stupid moment too. 
It's like, hey man, where's my phone? Like, where's my phone? I'm gonna do some of the vlog. Fucking, I was sat, like, I was staring at it. So it was right there. You were just looking at it. You just put it down to look for the for the fucking phone, you idiot. <sighs> oh. Just had the internet go down. Just found that my, well, it's not my Xbox, it's Inky's Xbox, wouldn't connect to one of our travel modems, which was a joy. It wouldn't do it over Wi-Fi. I'd just be like, no, DNS is wrong, DNS is wrong, DNS is wrong, we can't connect, we can't connect, we can't connect. Wire it in, it's like, uh, this isn't ideal, but we'll work now. So, great. That's, that's joy of joys sorted there. So I'm going to binge a bit of Dragon Ball before I pass out. Now I, I've run into a, a, a problem today. Uh, I tried streaming uh, Jump Force. I've never played Jump Force before. It's available on the uh, Xbox Game Pass. So you can get it for free. It's a pretty expensive game on every platform. I think it's on Xbox, PS4, and PC. And I think Dark Rider said that uh, the PC version, like with all the bits, is like 80 bucks. And it looks like it's about 80 bucks to, to get everything on the Xbox version too. But the base version of the game is currently free to play on Xbox. It's still about 40 or 50 quid to get the base version of the game. And from what I can tell, or from the thing that kind of made me like want to play it, was one, I had nothing else to play. Two... It looked a bit like uh, J Star's Victory Versus Plus that we played a while ago on um, PS4, like uh, a three-on-three -three Shonen Jump fighting game, and uh, it is a three-on-three -three Shonen Jump fighting game. It looks really pretty, really cool. There doesn't seem to be any like. They weren't flying in J Star's Victory Versus, were they? There were three story modes in Victory Versus. There's only one in, in this one that I can see. And just it doesn't It doesn't run well. It looks like a very good J Star's Victory Versus. It's not as chaotic because it's it's you have a team of three. And it plays like a uh, like a Marvel vs. Capcom style game in, in an open space whereby you... So in, in J-Star's Victory Versus, you would have all of your team, like all three players on your team and all three players on the enemy team would be on the map at once. In this, it's one member of each team is on the map and you can switch out and do assist attacks and stuff like that. Um, yeah, it, 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 it looks amazing, but it plays like turd. The frame rate, at least, is not great, and it's got a pretty solid cast of characters uh, with no Toriko in it, from what I can see. But it's got, you know, like it's got City Hunter, it's got Kenshiro, uh, you know, loads of characters from Naruto and Bleach and Dragon Ball and and uh, and, and others like My, Hem uh, My Hero Academia and, and and other characters from uh, from other other series. The, the 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 frame rate is really, 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 really bad, and during the stream. I was like, wow, this this doesn't look. I went to look back at some of the streams. I couldn't because I only played the game once. I couldn't tell if the issues I was having were just because of the game or because of the way I had it set up. I was playing, and the colours were pretty accurate. Um, after I fiddled, um, I was playing using this. I was thinking to myself, crap, have I have I plugged in like a cable that isn't capable of pushing the bandwidth? Because I was running it at seven twenty sixty. No way uh, was that game running at sixty frames a second. No way, which is probably partially, maybe possibly where this stuttering and stuff was coming from, but um, just it looked really, really bad on stream. And I kind of thought that with some of my Demon X Machina streams as well, but I put that down to the fact that I was using the X230 for a lot of those streams and not the, um, not the T430. Uh, I want to try and troubleshoot this stuff because I'm, I'm really worried that any stream I do in the future is going to have a really janky look and really, really stuttery feel to it. If it turns out it's just a bad cable, I know I've just gone off from like talking about Jace, uh, not Jace, that's really, um, Jump Force. Um, if it turns out it's a bad cable, I can test that tomorrow by grabbing another card that I have that literally craps the bed if you plug in something that doesn't offer it enough bandwidth. 
Um, I'm hoping it's not the laptops. I'm hoping it's not the capture cards. If it is the laptop or the capture cards, I have no idea. Um, oh, well, fingers crossed it might just be Jump Force, uh, to be honest. Because <laughs> a lot of times that really weren't happy running properly. Just saying. Like, I don't even know if it was running at 30 frames a second a lot of the time, but... <laughs> It's, it's, it's just a, a troubleshooting thing, you know? Because I'm not familiar with the game and the way it plays and the way it looks. Uh, you know, I'm just kind of like eyeballing it. It's like, oh, well, I'm pretty sure when I was playing it and all this stuff's going on on the screen, it was smooth. But then when you're watching it back, you know, and, and, and you're not as focused on what buttons to press and when to press them, you're starting to see things you didn't see to start with. So it's like, what well, you think you didn't see them to start with? And it's just like, ah, oh, you know... So I want to keep I want to keep playing it though. It has got me wanting. To, it wants me. I, it wants me. It, I want to play J Star's Victory Versus Plus again on the PlayStation Four because I mean that's again equally fun, shonen jumpy fighting game. Tons of cool characters. I think personally, Victory Versus has a better roster. Maybe. There are some cool characters in, in this new one, but I don't know if it quite balances out yet. I'll, uh, you know, I'm going to keep playing it, but I, just, I don't want things to look and sound crap if they don't have to. And everyone else is just like, I'm going to buy an ah! And then, you know, buy a new PC and that's it. Just press a button and go. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that, but I have the cash to do that anyway. Um, and when I did, I mean, look what happened. The, the <laughs> fans failed and stuff like that. Yeah, I'll, I'll check the bandwidth and stuff tomorrow. I mean, that's not going to be testing the USB 3 port on the laptop for bandwidth, but I'll be checking to see if the cable's okay and stuff like that. Um, currently waiting for Inky to come home. Because she's popped off to one of her mates. I'm just going to sound like I'm going off on one here, but I right now all I want to do, I'm waiting for Inky to come home, but I'm so fucking tired, I think I just might throw myself into bed. I'm biting off more than I can chew again as far as time is concerned. I know it doesn't seem like I'm doing a whole hell of a lot, but there's a lot of stuff I'm not vlogging and, and all that. And like, like I said, but, you know, now that mum's off work, um, she's realising that um, like six hours of free time doesn't really equate to a whole hell of a lot when you do another stuff. So like that could be like an hour of this, an hour of that, a couple of hours of this, and then obviously you're like, well, where the hell's all my free time gone? It's like because you've done these things. Um, that's what I've got here. I've I've got a very limited amount of free time that I can just dick around and experiment or or, or work on little things. And I'm just stacking more and more things to try and fit into that space, and it's just not working. It's just not working out. So other things are suffering, uh, you know, because I'm doing too much. Does that make any sense? Like there's, there's, you know, if I if I've got six hours in a day where I can do anything I want, and then I choose to do like fifteen things, you're not able to put a whole hell of a lot of of time into any one project or to really invest any of your or any of your uh, mental processes into doing something it's just not enough time to warm up get it done and then cool off it's kind of silly because I, I, I already i always cut things off always cut things off i wanted i wanted to make sure that i actually got something done this time but just um projects trips Trying to stay social with people, trying to keep up with uh, with emails and paperwork and and the streaming and the vlogging and the streaming and the vlogging is e the easy part, you know. Um, trying to be helpful, trying to be useful. I, I won't go into like how or why, but just I'm I'm trying to I'm just trying to help other people out. And I don't know if I'm doing a particularly good job because I'm spreading myself thin. I don't want everyone else to carry all the weight all the time, so I'm trying to take up as much of it as I can, and I just don't think I'm doing a very good job of it. I'm just a little overwhelmed at the moment. 
Hey ho. I think I'm going to go and head off. Now that I've got the internet working again. I've got the internet working again. I'm going to um, fire up some Dragon Ball on the Xbox. On Funimation. Or I might start watching Dragon Ball Super. Somebody watched like an episode, two episodes of that. Resurrection F and um, God of Destruction or whatever it was. The two Dragon Ball films that turned into two arcs of Super. I want to see what's going on because everyone's telling me about it and I have no idea. I just don't want to be rude. I just don't want to be rude to anyone and say, look, you know, can you guys wait for a bit? I don't want to be hugely selfish because I already feel selfish just by being. I think I'm going to go and make a cup of tea, shower, Dragon Ball, maybe Plinky Plink on the guitar for half hour. I hope you are. Sleep with a bit of luck tomorrow.